Ladies and gentlemen, we are live right here. MMA Reloaded presents Right Championships. I know I ain't done it in a long time. I'm still waiting for my live commentary videos to upload serial. But right now, for all my fans, we got Right Championships coming back right here for y'all. And right now, to start us off tonight, Jose Aldo and BJ Penn. I'm Jose Aldo here versus BJ Penn. Oof, God. As you can see here, I was aggressive, but like he was, he knew like throwing with BJ Penn. Yeah, he had to throw scrap, he had to scrap against me. So I, I took my time, as I always do. I time my shots a lot more. All right, right here. Uh, you know, he he knew that he was. He knew, yeah, that he was getting beaten there on the feet. Cut me in the clinch. I took him down there with a judo throw. I took him down for another one. <laughs> you see, because, bruv, you can't underestimate me in the clinch. Yeah? I'm, uh, I think I'm one of the best in the clinch. Alright, so as picture clears up. We go right back. I take him down. See, he thought that because he's BJ Penn, he's going to out grapple me. It's not going to happen. You know, my takedowns were the best weapon here in this fight. We kind of had a clinch war. So he, he comes down. We go back on the feet. In this fight, you know, I was thinking that, you know, I needed to time my shots. I always time my shots, you know. I'm not a wild guy unless I have to be. But unless the guy's being wild against me, that's when I have to be wild against them. Okay, you see, my grappling comes into play again. You know, that takedown was nasty, man. He he ran out of energy too early in this fight because he, he went wild too quickly. We're only 2 minutes 30 deep. And I'm already, I've already got him right where I wanted him. You know what I'm saying? A BJ Penn in the game is a very, very good fighter. You just have to know how to use him. You know, he's got good stand-up. Uh, but see, his hands... If you want to utilise his hands fully, yeah, you got to keep moving. There you see, man. As he comes in, he eats my elbow. I love doing elbows in, in UFC 2. That's one of my best weapons. Again, he goes for his, like, his fourth takedown. <laughs> Gets sprawled. You see, I, I love I love going into side saddle position because you know those elbows and side saddle are nasty. He had no defense right here, and it was all she wrote. No defense at all, man. When I got him into backside, and it was all she wrote, motherfucker. No surprise. I take him with Jose Aldo. This is why. <laughs> you never ever ever clinch out of desperation. Never clinch out of desperation, you know? I have something else right here for you. Ladies and gentlemen, on to our next fight right here on MMA Reloaded Ranked Championships. After Jose Otto. <laughs> we are live here. I was Yair Rodriguez for this one and tonight you're gonna and today you're gonna get a highlight real fight with Myself as Yair Rodriguez and my opponent as Anthony Pettis, two of the most highlight reel driven fighters in the UFC. Right here, as we go out, I think we ended in a decision here, I'm not sure. So let's find out. Oh! In this fight, you know, I knew it was going to be full of highlights. So I came in aggressive here in this one. You see me throw that combination right there. Little push kick to the body. I love throwing that one handstand kick. Oh, you see my combinations. He, he kind of sussed out my combination there. Bang, man. He was aiming there for my body a lot more. Bang, man. Had him with that uppercut. Caught him at the end of the uppercut there. Nice. I knew it, man. He was expecting a kick to the head. It kicked him right into the body. In this fight, you know, you can't ever sit down on Anthony Pettis. So that's why I being Yaya Rodriguez with the perfect counter to Anthony Showtime. Oof. See, we're going back and forth, man. 
kick after kick after kick. He was going for that body kick a lot, man. I hit him with that one hand stand. Boom, 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 boom. Didn't work. He showed good defense. I hit the switch kick right there. That connected and he knocked down. And that was all she wrote, I believe. Yes, it was. <laughs> AC, I, I kind of sussed out his technique in that one. You know, it's brilliant. You know, I sussed out his technique. And I uh, took advantage, really, man. I, you know, I knew that if I kept him going wild on that first knot, on that first rock, then that my cardio would have gone. So straight away, you know, I threw the switch kick. Luckily, his guard was down, and that was all she wrote. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> I hope you've enjoyed this episode, these edi this edition right here of MMA Reloaded's Ranked Championship. We are back with Ranked Championships here today and already two fights sorry they were so short you know what can i say you know i can't ev not every fight can go to decision all right so our third fight of this episode let's just await it right now i think i uh, can't remember the third fight i think it was something i think it was something good i made these let's see what this one was Ah yes, oh yes, oh hell yes, this one, I, I remember this one quite fondly still, but it was, um, it was Lorenz Larkin, uh, oh this one was Bruce Lee, he was, he was Bruce Lee for some reason yeah, which I find completely cheating, completely unnecessary yeah, yeah, especially at Bantamweight because no one can actually match Bruce Lee's stats. So I go for the man who I think can, Dominic Cruz. You know, I tried to use the Dominator to dominate. I did well, man, I believe. You know, Bruce Lee has superhuman ability in this game. Yeah, so I used my, I used what I could, man, to dominate, to go right after him. But I couldn't, man, for real, you know. And Yeah, see, so we both start feeling each other out, hit a few good kicks. On him, you know, and this was this was nasty. Oof. We go back and forth. He uses that couple where, they where when he's standing at distance, he knows that Bruce Lee's kicks are so fast in this game. I try the head kick, doesn't connect. I get completely fucked up here in this one. Try a flying knee because I needed to come back, man. You know, his hands and his feet were just moving there like animal bullets, man. <laughs> I land some few good shots there in the cl uh, up close. I try to keep my distance, you know, so he, you know when he comes in, I can catch him. But you know, it, could, it wasn't to be, man. I didn't catch him with that many sh good shots, you know, in this one. Bam! He kept him catching me with that front crane kick. I try. I managed to block it a few times. Nice, man. Jesus Christ. Oof! I did what I could against Bruce Lee. There's only so much you can do against Bruce Lee, man, in this game. He was going for that 360 tornado. I countered it. Um, catches me there with a body kick. I don't think he stops me in this one. I think we go to a decision now. Let me see. Oof! Call me with a dragon kick there. Oh my god! Oh my days! He doesn't follow up. He didn't follow up there. See what I'm saying? That front green kick there was his best weapon. He didn't follow up on it though. And uh oh, rock, yeah, I rocked him right there. I rocked him right there. I rocked him right there, man, with that leaning left hand of Dominic Cruz. Try to finish it, but I couldn't hit him with a nice little elbow. I had to get him away from me, man, for real. Because he was coming in up close. His hands were moving like bullets. He rocked me so hard there. I knew what his tactic was. Go for the body, 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 and then... When I block my body, go for the head. But it wasn't going to happen, you know what I'm saying? And uh, I thought I gave it everything here, man, in this fight. You know, with Dominic Cruz, but Bruce Lee is just something else, man. Well, and again, he rocked me. I think it, he doesn't rock me here. Yeah, I make it till the end of the round. Oh, backside heel kick, beat. Hey, see, see what I mean when I said keep my distance? When he comes in, you know... I hit my, I go wild a bit there with the combination because I knew I had to do something. I got a bit frustrated. If I knocked him out, yeah, I was gonna put in my headset and say surprise, motherfucker. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, but 
It wasn't going to happen, mate. Bruce Lee was just... I don't know why they put Bruce Lee as a playable character in this game. He's too good. I, especially online. Tries that capoeira kick again. No, it doesn't connect. We've got three seconds. I went smart at the end of the round. Dodged the kicks. I landed on my own. We both rocked each other there, but obviously you would give it to him. You know, he landed more volume of striking. You know, but... I came forward, I hurt him. I'm glad. I, I was actually proud of myself in that round still. But that kick was nasty. If I was him, I would have followed up on me. Yeah, and I would have TK I would have got to TKO. It would have been so hard for a guy to recover. Because his head his head damage was already red. I'm not like martial mind where you know I only show myself winning. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Uh, Marshall, me, I'm still waiting for that, for that call out, bro. I called you out a long time ago. Yeah, if you want to fight, let's do this, mate. Hit me up, Arjun and Niche, ninety four. Yeah. We go down to round two. Round two, I tried to, I tried everything in this round, man, to to sort of get the stoppage here. Yeah, I hurt him a couple of times there at the start. I was smart. I was using my reach. There you see, man. As I, as I came in forward, there he hurt me. Even on strikes. I did well in this round. I'd still, but... Yeah. 